In the 1930s, Robert Moses was pretty much considered the master designer of New York City. He was the park's commissioner and had an incredible influence on public projects and infrastructure. He was also low-key racist and discriminated against people of color, minorities, and the middle class in general. For example, he didn't want poor people visiting New York City's pristine beaches. So on roads that led to the beach, like the Long Island Parkway, he designed the overpasses to be so short that no public transportation bus could go through them. And since poor people couldn't afford cars, this basically made New York City's beaches inaccessible via public transport. And his discriminatory design doesn't just end there. He went out of his way to clog poor neighborhoods with cars while preserving the richer neighborhoods. As you can see in this example, the Robert F. Kennedy Bridge exit ramp goes straight into Harlem, when the logical place would be Upper East Side, especially given the fact that most of the traffic originates below 100th Street. Follow for more design secrets.